ticket. It was the hottest ticket in town, but the event erupted in violence. After Chris Stapleton's stop at the Shoreline Amphitheater this summer, one man was killed, an off-duty officer was beaten up, and now months later, police say they have arrested several people tied to the Hells Angels. Crown Force Teresa Astacio has the story. Chris Stapleton's concert at the Shoreline Amphitheater in Mountain View in June was a must-see for thousands of fans as it shot to the top of the top-selling concerts this past summer. But near the end of the concert, something went terribly wrong. At 1045, Mountain View police arrived on the scene after reports of a badly beaten man found unconscious. 41-year-old Juan Gonzalez from Bakersfield died of his injuries a week later. This is Katie Nelson with the Mountain View Police Department. It, it was an absolute tragedy. Um, you know, everything... Everything is done to keep Shoreline safe. And Logan Winterton of San Francisco has now been arrested in his death. Cron 4 has learned he was tracked down in Chicago. It was one of five search warrants conducted by 13 different law enforcement agencies, including the FBI. Today was the culmination of all that work, all of those partnerships and abilities to be able to reach out to our law enforcement uh, family and seek guidance and assistance and help. Um, and really, it, it very hard work, uh, very well done, and uh, we're very relieved that we're one step closer to some justice for the victims in these cases. Besides the homicide of Gonzalez at the concert, an unidentified off-duty officer was also beaten up. The arrests in total include Dominic Godardo of San Francisco. He was arrested for allegedly dissuading a witness to a crime. Julio Moran of San Mateo for assault as well as David Weisenhaven of San Francisco on assault and Raymond Cunanan of Pleasant Hill on dissuading a witness and assault. We have any idea of what transpired to set off these things? All we know is that confrontations took place at this time. We're still conducting interviews, uh, but those confrontations obviously led to um, what we have now, which is an assault and then a homicide. Nelson says detectives discovered all five suspects know each other and have ties to the Hells Angels Motorcycle Club. All five are in custody and will be prosecuted in Santa Clara County. Teresa Estacio, Cron for News.